Solar definitely increases the value of your home, but the question is how much? The only ammo the solar industry has at this point is this appraiser's journal article that everybody quotes until they're blue in the face, and it's over 10 years old. It says that for improvements you make to your home for energy, every buck a year you save, it adds 15 to 20 times that to the value of your home. So if you got double pane windows and it saved you $1,000 a year in electricity, that adds $20,000 to your home. No one's buying that. So short of the National Association of Realtors publishing a report with solid data on the turnover of homes with solar, hint, hint, let's look at it through a different lens. Forget solar for a second, let's look at an example of something that happens in the Los Angeles area all the time. There's this one street called La Palma Avenue, and it's on the border between Anaheim City and Fullerton City. Anaheim has super cheap electricity. On the other side of the street, Fullerton's got expensive electricity. Let's take two identical families living in identical track homes on either side of the street. They both use the same amount of power, we'll say 2,000 kilowatt hours per month. The Fullerton side pays over $3,553 more per year for its power. Now, if you're a buyer looking at two identical homes on the same street, one of those pays you an annuity of $3,500 a year in cash, which one would you buy? Tell me a prospective homeowner wouldn't look at that in the same light as better school districts or property taxes. Now let's bring solar back in the picture. Buying a home with solar has lower power costs than the same home without it. I'm telling you, power saving is the new black when it comes to homes. Homes with power saving or in low cost power areas are gonna get paid more attention. They'll be evaluated just like school districts or property tax. If you have any more questions, I've put all the details and all the math at onebog.org slash home value.